For most of this past season, the Montana State football team looked darn near unstoppable. Behind a lightning quick running attack and voracious defense, the Bobcats seemed poised to make a return trip to the FCS championship. But then MSU ran into a buzzsaw in Brookings, South Dakota. And while this season may have ended in disappointment, these Bobcats have a lot to look forward to, including a recruiting class loaded with homegrown talent. It was unfortunate that that game played out the way it did. We needed to play really well. We needed to you know, do the, the simple things that when you're playing against a real good team were, were hard for us that day. A tough ending to what had been another magical season, but now it's time for the Bobcats to lick their wounds and press on. Still a little fresh, I guess, but you, you got to be able to move on. And, and I think our guys, you know, Come January, we'll be, we'll be the 23 Bobcats and ready to go. And while this latest loss may still sting, Vegan recognizes what an incredible accomplishment it's been for this team to advance to the semifinals for the past three straight seasons. What I like to think is maybe in the three years that this program has made the semifinals, it went from being, wow, we're in the semifinals to uh, that's where we expect to be. Wednesday was also signing day and Vegan announced a 25 player class including 12 Montanans. Those Treasure State players are Helena Capitals Tom Carter and Talon Marsh, Bozeman's Everett Carr and Luke Smith, Missoula Sentinels Adam Jones and JJ Dolan, Florence's Patrick Duchesne and Jonathan Lumen, Great Falls Cole Taylor, Helena's Culture Petrie, Melstone's Bryce Greeby and Fairview's Hunter Charbonneau. For Vegan, having Montanans as the bedrock of his program is a high priority. We have the, the ability here to have our Montana guys be our foundation, and, and that's not lip service. We need guys in our state to come here and thrive uh, on the football field. And for these homegrown players like Tommy Malott, having grown up around this program means they might just do whatever it takes to make the most of that opportunity. It's just a little bit different than maybe a guy from out of state. You know, to go to Montana State and you're from Montana, you want to you wanna make right by that opportunity. So the guys are going to do whatever they can. And I, you know, I think just the quality of people and the work ethic and the fabric of our state lends itself to guys that it, you know, you want in your teams. And Vegan is committed to keep stockpiling his roster with players that hail from Big Sky Country. There's good football played, high school football played in Montana, and uh, you know, we're going to continue to to get the very best that we can. Well, I hope you're all warmer than I am right now. In Bozeman, Luke Shelton, MTN Sports.